I'm standing here at the Ravenna Bridge, which is the only heatable railway bridge in Germany. Because of this, it can withstand ice and snow in winter. Dense evergreen forests, over 6,000 kilometers of natural landscapes and picturesque villages. Welcome to the Black Forest of Germany. Or as they say in German, Willkommen im Schwarzwald. Our first stop in the Black Forest is the town of Treberg, which is famous for its cuckoo clocks and Germany's highest waterfall. In fact, the whole region of Black Forest is actually famous for cuckoo clocks. So it's not a surprise that the world's largest cuckoo clock and the world's smallest cuckoo clocks are both found in this area. So here we are at the world's largest cuckoo's clock. It's not the one behind me, it's on the other side of the building. But the one behind me has a cuckoo's call. If I put a one euro coin, we can actually see and hear the cuckoo's call. And the lady behind me, you can see she's wearing the traditional and very unique headdress. Let's try the cuckoo's call. Press it. Oh, it's happening. And now we're going to have a look at the waterfalls. We can also feed the squirrels here in the waterfall area. Let's see if we find some. I can already see it. You should always maintain social distance here. It's lucky for us that it's very easy to do because there's no one here. By the way, this costs around six euros entrance. Yeah. I'm waiting for the <laughs> squirrels to come. Oh, they're in the sign. Unfortunately, this time we didn't find any squirrels. No. So now we reach the famous 360 degree curve. This cross sign signifies it. And this is a very famous and quite dangerous 360 degree curve in Höllental called Kreuzfelsenkurve. Make sure to slow down and drive carefully. Here you can see the so called Hirschsprung Gorge, the spot where, according to legend, a stag leapt over the Höllental. The distance seems way too wide now to jump across, but apparently it used to be much more narrow before road construction. This is greener than the other area, that's what I said. 300 meters, turn left. Right next to the Black Forest, we have the sunniest city in Germany, the city of Freiburg, or specifically as we say, Freiburg im Breisgau. It's a historic jewel with a medieval city center, green environment and attractive gothic buildings. And it's also a very, very bike friendly city. At the moment, the rules here say that you're supposed to wear a mask whenever you're walking through the crowded inner city area. So, let's explore the city. Right in the center of the city, we have a gorgeous 800-year-old cathedral called the Freiburg Minster. It has more than 91 gargoyles, the statues which stick out from the wall, and 19 bells. Luckily, it survived the bombings from both the world wars, so we can enjoy its beauty even today. And right next to it, there is a very interesting building here. It's called the Historic Merchants Hall. 
and it looks like it's something straight out from a fairy tale. One of the most interesting and unique things about the Freiburg city are these small water channels which run alongside the streets here. In the olden times, they were used to feed animals and fight fires. Nowadays, they are used to cool down the city in the summer. Compared to the other cities in the world where such channels of waters are often used as sievers and gutters, here it's forbidden to use them as sievers. Actually, these are called Bechle and according to locals, if you accidentally step into one of those, you will marry a person from Freiburg. So be careful. Be, be careful. <laughs> they even have little boats for it. You may have heard of black forest cake. It's a popular traditional sponge cake made with cream, cherries and chocolate. We weren't allowed to eat it inside the restaurant as you can only take food to go at the moment. It is actually unknown if it originates from this area, but the cherries on top sure remind of the traditional Black Forest headdresses. If you're up for a little challenge, try ordering the Black Forest cake in German. It's called Schwarzwälder Kirschtorte. There's actually a piece of black forest right here inside Freiburg. It's called Schlossberg Freiburg. We are right here and it's a 20 minute walk to reach the Schlossberg Tower which is a viewpoint for the whole city. There used to be a castle up here in the Schlossberg Hill but it was destroyed in the 1740s. That's where the name of this hill comes from. But it offers fabulous views over the whole Freiburg city, 360 degrees. Hope you got a brief nice overview of all the things in the Black Forest area. If you enjoyed this video, do subscribe to the DW Travel channel for more such videos. See you next time.